My name's Jeb, and this is not the doomed plant. Now this one, on the other hand... <laughs> This video is sponsored by Maxi Sun. This one's got Samsung LEDs and a mean well driver. The heat sink is heavy duty. <laughs> ah, the warm glow of a full spectrum light. I sprayed it. I don't know. Do you think it's the spray that's the damage? Yeah. Oops. Hydro is my usual forte, but got to try new things too. try to figure out what's bothering these leaves. I almost feel like it's safe not to wear sunglasses under the 10%. Is it going to do well? What do you think? I think it's going to do well. I'm thinking this new worm casting product might be able to revive the plant. Hundred percent, baby. Woo! This is when I realized I'd been overwatering the plant. I thought as long as I had runoff, it'd be okay. Okay, I'm going to let the top dry out, and this thing will be fine.
So did the leaf die and then the mold came? Or did it catch a mold that killed it? My backup plant has issues too. Maybe it's just too early in the season. The environment seems pretty good. Sulfur. Vacation's coming. Gotta just hope for the best. I wonder if Lysol can kill early blight spores. I'm feeling lazy, so I'm not gonna transplant it. I think this spray might be better for peppers. I probably should have transplanted, but I just need cuttings. Gotta sterilize these tools too. Day three, I found an empty tomb. I was able to clone so fast at 40% light. I don't have hydroponic totes ready. I've still got the old paint. This season's going to be storage tubs against trash cans. I'm all done with the two inch net cups too. These little cages should be fun. It's almost as tall as a regular tomato cage. It's just got shorter feet. I am going to need both hands to bend these under.
hopefully the chickens won't be too interested in these tomatoes. got a trash can in mind for this plant. Twin Turbo. Click the link in the description and buy one of these grow lights.